everybody, welcome back to another video. We're going to start a new series on Stardew Valley. As you can see, I already have a uh, game on here. Right here. But, I'm going to start a new one because why not? Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just make our name. Um, I guess it's a movie. I don't know. I'm just trying to make it Um, That's my favorite thing. So if you hear that, then it's fine. Anyways, let's see here. And for my very special grandson. I want you to have the sealed envelope. I've seen this already, but for you that haven't, I'm just gonna go through it. No, no, don't open it yet. You have, have patience. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burned, bur by the burned of modern life. I think it's burned. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing, before a growing emptiness. So. When that happens, my boy, you be ready for this gift. Um. I'm not good at expressions for this, so I'm just gonna read my normal voice. Now let's let Grandpa Russ. Twenty years later, that's one X is a um ten years ten, so that's twenty because there's two of them. Anyways, just tell me. Um, terminated. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And then if we look on the complete left month, it's done. We have a skeleton. I uh, have a skeleton. Yes, skeleton right here on the left. No, our pe person's right here. Yeah, let's open it up. If you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature, so I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy. The cropland farm is located in Stew Stardew Valley on southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This is my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. P.S. If Luis is still alive, say hi to the little guy for me, will ya? And then comes to the final—not uh, final cutscene. Actually, there's so many of these things. That I think randomly happen when uh, some event is triggered. Mm -hmm. Okay, 
what's going on right here. 25 miles. Uh, yeah. Oh, you must be Timmy. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis, is, Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. Here's the right... He's there right now, trying things up, tidying things up for your arm. I'm not good at reading, okay? The farm... The farm's right over there. Over. The farm... Right, oh, the farm is right over here. If you you will follow me. I can't do that. You'll follow me. Uh, I don't. It's gonna take forever because just me reading this. Oh wow! Oh, it looks like when you first come. This is the cropland farm. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's still there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. And here we here you are your new home. Ah, the new farmer. Look, I'm, I'm Luce, mayor of Pelican Town. You know everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house, very rustic. Rustic, that's one way to put it. Rusty might be a little bit more AP. I don't know what that means, though. Don't listen to her, Tony. She's just trying to make you just have this five so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Oh, and I almost forgot. If you have anything up to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Very well, good luck. Very well. It said well. I'm... Ignore what I say, okay? You can read it yourself if I don't make sense. Uh, so yeah. Here we are. It's got the seeds. Um, also, it's it's right click to open the stuff, not left. We see 15 part of seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Barely this. Um, it looks like it's, uh, what's that? Six? The recording thing kind of blocks it. I wish I could hide it, but I'm not going to. Anyways, uh, as we have here, you can see that we have to work on this. I'm going to get started on this, and um, I'm going to leave most of it in, um, just because it's going to, just because uh, I need to get at least some good spot. Probably going to start farming right here. Now, a good thing to do at the start is once you uh, for what I do, one thing that you can do is go and get a, uh, get, you do farming, do fishing, which you get after a few days, but I'm not good at it, so I just do farming and chat around a lot. Just chat a lot, so, yeah. What I do after, what I do after this is, um, is I would... Hold on, let me organize this. Well, after after I do clean up all of this, I, I put it in the box to just sell and then I'll, you know. 
um, you get rocks usually from these uh bigger ones right here that I'm mining. That that's where you get coal and stuff, which once you get from this recipe, uh, which you get randomly one day. Then yeah, I think my food's coming. So, oh no, that's my sister. Okay. Uh. Anyways, I'm going to collect a few of these things. Uh, go and chop down this tree. Also, if you're new to the game, make sure not to leave the stump behind or it's, it's just kind of useless to chop them down. And there we go. Uh, uh, here we go. Grab this. And then now that I'm done, I'm going to put it the cell box. There we go, that should give me a bit of money. Wait, you don't need to do that, hold on. Oh, you can use our pickaxe to make it back to normal. Come on. What did I just pick up? Also, you can get dogs and cat, it just depends on what you get gifted. Uh, one of the days. So, uh, the other, there's a rancher, not a farmer, there's a, someone that ranches and animals, and they give you, by luck, cat or dog. I think it's actually if what type of thing you pick for your front picture that I did earlier. That's what I'm thinking it is, because I did dog and I got dog last time. Anyways, uh, I'll show you. So basically, if you get a dog, you can go up to here, and you will be able to water it. And once you get the dog, so don't do it now because then it's just wasting time. Uh, you can fill this up at you can fill your thing up at any area here. Uh, crafting is crafting. I'll show you where it is. All right here, you go to crafting. You have all of this. Uh, furnace would be right here. You also get sprinklers, cherry bombs, which you can find in the mines. That will be unblocked soon. Mines will be right here. No. No. Hold on. If you come here, this is carpenters. So, it would be... Yeah, it would be right here. Mines. That's it. I'm pretty sure it's blocked right now, but yeah. Anyways, now that I'm done with that, I'm going to go ahead and say hi to some of the people because that's our first mission. Getting started. Move on, yes. Um, introduction. I've only met two people Mayor Lewis and Robin, I'm pretty sure it is. Um, I played this for like two days, two and a half days, basically. Two and one quarter days, actually, on my other thing. I got okay. I didn't actually for a while, and I didn't know how to collect the thing because of the whole button being so. Sometimes you can use left mouse button, but a lot it's right. Well, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop, which is right basically. Stop if you need any refreshments. I've always got hot coffee and cold beer. Oh, oops, did not need to click that. Yes, you can search these garbage cans, but uh, if they can't shoot, then you. This is Abigail here. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving into that, onto that old farm. It's kind of a shame. I really shame. Really, I. It's kind of a shame. Really, I always enjoy exploring those overgrown fields with farms. And back here we got a uh, Harry, the the, the chocolate. Hey, it's. Mr. Timmy, the new farmer. I'm Perry, the owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I also buy pro produce from you for a good price. A little agriculture could really inject new life into the local economy. Uh, and then back here, you can actually walk in and you have Abigail's room. I'm pretty sure that's the this is on Fridays they do yoga night. I have no idea what that is. I guess just a little church area, religious area. And then you come here. Oh, uh, I've actually never 
You must be Timmy, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. My husband is a general store here, runs the general store here, and I have, and have you met my daughter, Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple hair. Okay, anyways, I've actually never been back here. Okay, never mind. Can't go there. Um, let's go back here. And I guess now that we have 500 coins, I won't get a few more um, parsnips. Actually, no, I'm gonna get some potatoes. Actually, uh, also there is there is seasons. Uh, so you want to get you want to get the right stuff for the right season. And if you if it, the season changes, uh, then then the uh. Uh, if the season changes, your crops die, so you gotta plan ahead of time. Um, right now it's Monday 1st, so we can basically grow any crop. Um, right now I'm just gonna go ahead and plant the potatoes, because that should be extra money. Uh, so yeah. Then after that, I might go ahead and say hi to a few more people at the rancher. Uh, if you, if you get animal, if you take care of animals, then, then, uh, then she uh, will become a friend with you. Actually, that's what I, I that's what I think because that's what she says in one of her text bubbles that she that pops up. Um, it says something like on the lines of, "If you take care of animals well, I'm sure we'll get along well." Anyways, um, yeah. Oh, energy. That's right. Uh. How, what, oh, I know a good way to get energy. You can just explore the areas, like right here. Some, so you see these bushes here? They all grow stuff on them. Though, I don't think anything has grown lately, actually. Like, the flowers aren't here, are they? Nope, they're not. Hmm. Anyways, that's a good thing. You can find nanny lines and stuff. And also, sometimes this little, I call it magical thing. I think it's from, like, the wizard, creation of the wizard tower over here. Right, ah, uh, right here or something like that. Uh, you can find a little thing that sells flowers and other stuff. Um, okay, we're, I don't think anything has grown, but I can try to look for a few things. Oh, here, someone else. I'm the kids there. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but okay, I'm Jody. It's quite a little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Have, having a farmer around could really change the things. And this is, uh, what's his name again? Vincent. Oh, strang- Oh, a stranger. My name is- I can't even pronounce her name. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but maybe this is okay. This, each episode's probably gonna be like half an hour, you know. Probably not gonna cut anything out because that'll be a pain looking through everything. Why, hello. And welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. Uh, their house, I believe, is the one right here. No, 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 it's not. It's the one up here, isn't it? Yeah, right here. This is it. Um, if we actually go in right now, his little uh, guy, this little guy is here. Hmm, it's interesting to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name, name's George. By the way, now buzz off. Hmm. Yeah, he's not very nice to strangers, is what the granny says when she's cooking over there. Um, in here, I've never been. I've been here like one other time because she doesn't like people don't like being here. Oh, hello, I'm Petty. Um, because the owner of the house, when she's not in there, she doesn't like people going in there, but she'll tell that later. Actually, no, here it is right now. Here she is right now, the owner of that house. Oh, aren't you the new one? Aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community. Dynamic. It's exciting. Um, and then over here, I'm pretty sure this is the mom of one of the. No, it's not. Ooh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love 
a year in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon, that's where I work. Okay, and then here is another house. Uh, no one is in here right now. And then, oh, no. Whoops. I keep accidentally doing that. That's like the first time I've done that for a while. You know what's in here? I don't think people like me as much because I've accidentally done that twice. Um, here is the farmer person should be in here right now. Yes, yes, my um, the daughter. Hi. Yeah, that's what she says at first. And then here. Ah, Mara Lewis told me it just arrived in Mar me. I'm Mar. It sells. I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by. You should swing by sometimes. Um, I think that's everybody I can get to right here. Yeah, you have to be friends with people to go in the more private rooms. Uh, out the rooms. And houses. Uh, let me see. Okay, uh, let's go over here. If I'm correct, there should be a bridge. Oh, here. Here we go. Good. Finally, something that I can eat. Eat that. Um. Uh, have they grown yet down here? No, they have not grown yet. Okay. Usually there's some food down here. All of these bushes here, like these type of bushes here and here, and maybe this one here, right next to me, um, they will probably get berries sooner in the year, later in the year. Uh, um, anyways, we're just gonna, that's all I was gonna do for episode one to see if you liked it. Uh, I'm gonna go back to the crops very quickly, and, you know, oh, here we go. Hello, it's nice to meet you. You've picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. Okay. Um, and then... And, no, actually, before I go, I... Um, I'm going to go ahead and say hi to the person in the Adventure Hunters Guild. Okay, let's see. You should be... If I go here... A second, we'll meet myself. Come back. I just got food, so yeah. Here we go. Probably. Have you met everyone in town yet? Sounds exhausting. Oh, I have I? Some people. Okay. Uh, there should be a few people in here. I don't think I can get to them right now. Oh, yes I can. There we go. This is a scientist. Greetings. I'm Dem Etrius. Local scientist and farmer. And father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Come on, I'm champ. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home. I have a daughter. I met my daughter, Mario. She's interesting to me. She's interested to me. Can I sneak in? Nope. Oh. No. And down here is a. Oh, he's not here right now. Okay.
I think it's 8 p.m. Anyways, um. Ah, oh, here we go. Man, slide. <laughs> That's right. And then, then there's a um, poor person here. Oh, that's right. We can find food here sometimes. Sometimes wild plants will grow here, and then you can eat them. Okay. Um. Oh. Not used to all this stuff being here right now. Um, and we'll all sleep and then end the video. So that saves. See, $150. Okay, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, um, leave a like and I'll continue doing this. And, um, share us to everybody. I know I'm going to have some people watching this because my friends at uh, school got information that I was going to be doing this video, so yeah. Thanks, goodbye.